Hi, my name is Keith. The clips you're getting ready to see are from a trip that I took to China. I was stupid when I made some of the comments there. China has an exceptionally good workforce, and I want the Chinese government to understand that I truly appreciate their contributions. Um, I don't want them to be upset at me. I would like for them to drop all the import duties on the products that I particularly bring in because I'm getting ready to allow um, JLIP Group to produce all the products that I have there and to put them in China because they're so valuable. So please place that under consideration. Um, I understand why the Chinese government maybe have been monitoring me and, and preventing uh, JLIP Group from shipping products to me because of the, the value that they see. Know that I can help you also if you just trust me a little bit and go forward that there's a lot of things happening in my world that affect your world and I sincerely appreciate you leaving me alone at least for the time being. Please understand that I'm here for your benefit as well as mine. I don't want to take Chinese manufacturing away from China. Uh, they're exceptionally good people. You have home, no homeless people. No homeless people. I have a solution in America how we can get rid of homeless people here. Thank you for that. I appreciate that. And please understand all the other political groups that are going to get screaming mad at me because of the things I'm promoting and doing. I'm here for everyone's benefit. And you can tell by my voice that I mean it. And I'll pro I hopefully will never provide a... I have a problem and find a solution where the solution causes other problems that that hurts uh, one group and makes another group benefit. I want everyone to benefit, and you'll understand that with the psychology that I've learned. Here's a few clips when I was speaking. A typical Chinese workstation, uh, at least uh, it's pretty hot. One suggestion I'd have here would be to build a box with one side open so that it needs to get in and out. So he's actually handling the material multiple times. The main thing is and also the other thing is, it gets awful hot here. It'd be nice if they had a fan to blow the, to blow the fumes away. At least he is wearing, he is wearing glasses. Right, it's Keith Duncan with a bunch of companies built by Keith.com, IC Stan, and Foam Cradle. It's mostly here for IC Stan. This is actually the powder coat room. I just want to show some of the Chinese methodology. They have this huge tunnel here. We'll flip around right now and walk through it. Huge tunnel is the length of the entire room, and apparently they fire this puppy with coal, with uh, with wood, and they use it for powder coating. So we'll take a look at some other things here. This is the start of the powder coat room. Apparently, someone stands here and uh, sprays the different devices, uh, the different things they're going to do, and then it goes into the kill on the other side. So there's actually three production lines here that go into one line to the furnace on the other side. So this is where they're making the, uh, the powder coating for the icy stand weighted bases.